thank you for clicking. Please thumbs up if you haven't already. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And today we'll be continuing on with Prince Edward's life history. This is session number six and it's called In the Media. And the source I'm reading from is Wikipedia. If you need to catch up on previous episodes, we have got a playlist and it's called Prince Edward's Life History. And you'll also find it on the community tab and in the playlist section. We also have Queen Elizabeth II's Life History and Princess Anne's Life History. And session number six was called... I do apologise. Session number five was called Activities. And today's session is session number six and it's called In the Media. So let's go. In 1999... Edward was criticised by Labour MPs John Cryer and Lindsay Hoyle for comments he made during an interview with the New York Times in which he stated that in Britain they hate anyone who succeeds Mm. and America is where the money is. Oh wow. (laughs) The criticism prompted him to issue a statement clarifying that offending the British public was the very last thing I would have wanted to do. In 2011, close associates of Jonathan Rees, a private investigator connected to the News International phone hacking scandal, stated that he had penetrated Edward and Sophie's bank accounts, oh my goodness, and sold details about them to the Sunday Mirror. Source I'm reading from is Wikipedia, in case you'd like to follow that up. And that brings us to the end of session number six, which was called In the Media. Um, Session number seven will be called Titles, Styles, Honours and Arms. And we will be catching up with that later on 